So good Monday, everybody. Today, I am going to show you a productivity tip. And this has to do with M connectors and developing M connectors. I'm going to show you an example and what we're going to do. But basically, what I'm going to show you is how to deploy M connectors fast. And you know how much I love productivity tips. So let's do that in just a second. So hello there. Do you know that I publish Power BI videos every Monday, Wednesday and Fridays? So make sure you hit the subscriber button and the bell to receive notifications every time I do that. Okay, so as you can see here, this is my YouTube report. I use this report for following how my YouTube channel is doing, right? And uh, as you can see here, it says the number of subscribers. Well, I haven't updated for a while. We are over 15,000 now. Thank you. This is completely wrong. This is wrong. It says I have 12 likes for the entire life of the channel, which it's not true. 38 shares out of 50 comments. So as you can see, the report is broken. And the reason for this is because the YouTube team has deprecated or, you know, stopped maintaining version one of the API. And that's the one that I was using or Miguel Escobar was using. This is his connector. I just downloaded and use it. Thank you, Miguel. You're a star. And um, now it's broken. So I have to update it to version two. And I have done that. Then obviously there's something wrong because yeah, this is what I'm getting. It is updated, but I am getting tons of errors. And I'm not sure why it probably has to do with some of the fields or um, I actually don't know, but you can see that it's giving me uh, the wrong data. So um, I've been working on this a little bit on the weekend. And, you know, when you are deploying um, connectors, you here's the, the code for the connector. You do the changes and then you click here on build, build solution. And it will build to here, YouTube analytics, being, I'm doing this with Visual Studio, by the way, debug, and then this file, you need to copy to a folder that you created and the documents called Microsoft Power BI Desktop Custom Connectors. I have here all my custom connectors. So you have to copy and paste every time you do a change. And that is a pain. And you may say, okay, that's not the end of the world, but still i mean I, I like to be productive this is horrible so i came across inkeb's tweet it's going to show up uh, somewhere and uh, she said hey and she actually tagged me and, and miguel escrobar i'm not sure everybody got it but <laughs> except me this was a year ago and Inke said uh custom connector developers this tool lets you deploy the meds directly to the Power BI folder. So we're going to install that. And we're doing this live, so if something breaks, bear with me. <laughs> Let's see, where do I have it? I have it here. So I'm going to link to um, how to deploy, you know, to the this tool in the description box and make sure you subscribe to you because she is really, really, really good. So download and then install. I, I'm guessing that I will have to close Visual Studio. Let's do it ahead. And now it's going to install that. Early morning, need lots of coffee. It says select products that you want to install. Sure, go for it. Installing out to deploy. Updating configuration. I might use fast forward this if it takes a long time. I have no idea. That's as I say, I'm doing it live. So we'll see. But what it says actually, we can start looking at it as well install. It says. Uh, Okay, install it and then it says here how to deploy enable and then you can here tell them somehow which folder you want to how to deploy. Uh, and then it will have to deploy it there, making the development of custom connectors or at least the testing of custom con connectors much easier. Okay, so let's go back to 
this is the build, the YouTube analytics, uh, li- I don't know how you call these things, but you know, the library, where all the code is basically, where you go and tinker with the code. Uh, and build out the plug enable, out to the plug configuration, maybe. Default. Oh my god. I'm so excited. <laughs> this is what I wanted. Custom target directory. I don't know what this is. Oh, yay. Oh. Okay, let's do it again. Build, deploy configuration. Add new item is, of course, the mass file that we want to auto deploy. And then this is the target place. I did not click cancel. Let's do it again. Oh. This is the mass file. Put it in there. Okay. Build, auto deploy, enable. Yay! Build solution. Did it build there? Yes, 29th of October, 11th, 29. We can give it a hard code test because if I remember, if I remove a comma, this thing is going to crash and it should crash also in Power BI. So let's build a solution. And if I then go in here, it's going to crash anyway because it's crashing due to the... No, there you go. The import YouTube analytics matches no exports. It means your power connector is broken. <laughs> I wish it would say it's that. It would say that. So I go in there. I build it again. And then I go in here. And now it's working. Again, it is not working because I have some other problems with the connector, but but it, it is like the normal problems. So now you know how to deploy. This is going to be so much easier. So now I've got to get back to work with this. So I make it work. But have a great Monday and I'll see you again, I think, already tomorrow. Bye.